this video tutorial, I will show you how you can install the Atlantis ISIS viewer. So when you log into your Atlantis account, and you have a case ready for viewing, you should see the status hold for design approval on a bridge case. If you click on any one of the jobs, you'll come to a hyperlink which is click here to download the Atlantis Superstructures Viewer installer file. Click on the here button and the installer file should download. Once that's complete, click on open. You'll have, do you want to allow this app to, uh, uh, from an unknown publisher to make changes to your device? You click on yes. and then you'll have the installer file pop up. Click on next and follow the instructions, accept the user agreements. This information doesn't really matter, but you could put any information you'd like. Click on next, allow for all computer, well, all users to use the software in this computer and then click on next until the installer completes. Once that's complete, you can click on run now. Once the Atlantis ISIS viewer was installed, you'd need to go back to your Atlantis project Go to the design file and click on the file itself to start the download. I've already done this and this is at the bottom of my screen. If you click on show folder, it will show you where it's downloaded the case. In my instance, it's in my downloads folder. So now you would need to just go to your Atlantis ISIS viewer icon on your desktop. Double click to open. Go to the top left where the, you see the superstructure icon. Select load and locate where that project is stored, which is in my downloads box. Click on hybrid, click on open, and you'll have a preview of the case. You can view the case automatically like so. You can click and show various items on the screen. You can also view from different angles or viewpoints by click. And you've also got a 2D section measuring tool or viewing tool with a scroll bar at the bottom of that. What that does is that it's, it pans across the arch and you can see by the dark color that's our framework and the light gray color is the STL diagnostic scan that you've sent through. You can check the distance uh, uh, between the two surfaces and whether you can judge whether you would have enough support or you need a lot more support for that frame or whether it's too buckly placed or lingually placed. All this information you can check this with the viewer. If you require any changes, you would add it onto your Atlantis notes and then send it back to the design team. You've also got more measuring tools. So let's hide this. You can measure certain points. Let's zoom in a bit. So you click on measure, click from one point to another, and you'll have a measuring tool. And this is pretty much all that is required for an assessing an Atlanta superstructure case.